Who is asking for TTIP? Did you hear civil society asking for it? I didn't. Did you hear the trade unions asking for TTIP? I didn't. Did you hear the NGOs ask for TTIP? I didn't. Did you hear the SMEs ask for TTIP? Well, some of them. Who asked for TTIP? Major corporations on both sides of the ocean. Who want TTIP? So ask yourself, who stands to benefit from this? TTIP is beneficiary for the big companies, but local producers, consumers, um, local farmers have to pay for this agreement. TTIP will undermine our animal welfare standards. It will bring an acceleration of the ongoing intensification of animal farming in Europe. that promise jobs and growth. And I think we have to ask what kind of jobs, what sort of growth. Our system is worse than you think. You will look at it and it is worse than you think. The great thing that we have in Europe uh, is uh, our approach to legislating with the precautionary principles. And this is not the same in the US. Lawmaking in the, in the US is basically that. Screening, looking if there is an effect, and then asking for more evidence and more evidence. And in the meantime, our food chain is, is always more contaminated. But a lot of citizens are, don't want to have GMOs on their plate. The European system, as much as not necessarily implemented the best way still allows us to have that protection. Biotech companies made it very clear that TTIP for them is really taking out the barriers uh, on GM. And what we really need to look at very seriously is the consequences of this. What's this going to mean for public health? What's it going to mean for food safety? What's it going to mean for the environment? What's it going to mean for farmers? It is a run for the lowest price and the lowest standards. I think there is zero chance that if those objectives are achieved, the higher standard prevails when the next situation arises. Big transnational companies as Monsanto or Kraft in food or Cargill in feed are trying to impose their standards for making more trade all over the sea. I guess the point is we're going to get rid of all the multinationals. All uh, well, multinationals are we, dead. We, we broke up. Thank you, sir. We as Greens in the European Parliament take the floor to raise our concerns, to raise your concerns. But we need your help. We cannot act without the massive support of citizens. So do participate at events. Do sign petitions. Be active against that negative TTIP.